is Magic Card there, maybe? Okay, that was a little fast, a little wide, but whatever. <coughs> We're a little bit of a hilly countryside here. Or And there's another sunflower uh, field. Those are very popular in this game. I don't know if that's actually, you know, if that's realistic or not, or there are that many sunflower fields out there. How am I doing on gas? Oh, lots of gas. Looks like everything's good. All my gauges are good. You know, my last uh, uh, trip, my last delivery I did uh, as a, uh, uh, a non-owner driver, um, I had to make a rest stop. So I was looking at my map and I was planning where I should make my rest stop, and I figured I'll make my rest stop on this last uh, stop on this one particular highway before reaching my destination. Um, I figured that'll be good because if I make any wrong turns, which I've done before, uh, it won't really cost me anything and I can you know, adjust as necessary. So, as I was pulling into that last available rest stop, my fuel indicator came up saying, you're running out of gas, you need some gas. So I pulled into the gas pumps, filled up, but then I couldn't get back into the rest area. So, I looked at my map and I saw that there was another rest area right beside my delivery drop-off point. So I drove up there and I went to that, but it turned out to be a hotel. And I had a load on, and it was like, yeah, you're probably not supposed to pull in with a load. There were no other vehicles in there with a load. Uh, but I did it anyways, and then I had to back out of that parking lot and uh, onto the road. And I managed to do it without actually hitting anybody, so I was rather happy about that. So that's another load right there I could probably pick up on the way out. So that's cool. Reversing, reversing, reversing. I don't even know where I'm going. Oh, oh, horrible. That was a trailer there. Awesome. Oh. Driving in this view is so hard. job here maybe even get a writer inside those markers right up to the dock oh I got a little cockeyed there Have a look at my 
parking. Oh, look at that. Was that not a perfect park job once? Right in dead. Oh, well, actually, I went too far uh, back. There we go. So let's uh, put my e brake on. E-brake off, drop the trailer, collect my money, and we're done. So before I end this video, I wanted to have a look around. There was a... Uh, I want to go find out what that is, so I'm just going to drive over there. Parking brake. <laughs> now, I'm curious. Can I set that as a GPS? Light. Darn it! Oh crap, Ola! Not paying attention. I thought I had a green light there. So what is that there? I wonder. Let's drive in and find out. Looks like another truck dealership. Oh, it's went all. I guess really the only thing to do is uh, pick up a load and uh, go somewhere else because my shop is back at home. Red light. 
Hey, I penetrate. I mean, a pedestrian. Look at that. You've got pedestrians. What a stupid place to put your traffic signals or your traffic lights, man. Right, or is that a recruitment center, or what is that? Is that a load? Oh no, that's a garage. This garage is available for 180 grand. Regrettably, you cannot afford it. <laughs> Looks like a pretty big garage. Alright, that was a bad idea. Okay, so Euro Truck Stimulator 2. That's my first delivery with my very own uh, truck. Everything went seemed well, except for that red light ticket I got after delivery. Um, so I'm going to keep driving for a while. I'll probably do another video once I'm ready to hire a new driver or buy a new garage or somehow expand. Uh, so thanks for watching. Cheers. Alan, just listen to some Metallica for me. Crash man crashing! Never, never, never wanted any more guy you with the stone go blow. Crazy. Don't go crazy, you know. Okay, enough of that. Bye-bye. Well hey, so I'm actually back for just a uh, quick little update. I just did another delivery. Um after dropping off that load that you just watched, I went and picked up another load and came into Luxembourg. Um and I, uh, turns out you gotta pay a little more attention to uh um this rest stop stuff because as soon as you hit that timer um, you get a penalty for avoiding resting <laughs> which is what I got so I dropped off my load and I came over to this garage and I rested so now I'm back up um, and I figured I'd check out this uh, garage services that are available if we look over to the right um, you can see that little icon there um, and you have options you have a, uh, uh, to upgrade your truck or to do stuff like that so what I did was I repainted my truck so I gave it a custom paint job. Very happy with that. It cost like 8,000 euro, but whatever. I got a custom paint job. There's a couple other icons around here that I kind of want to check out. I don't know what they are. Like this one here. Some sort of a... Oh, this must be a dealership. Okay, this is another dealership. I wonder which one this is. I have no idea. Or it's closed. Why is it closed? Oh, it opens in a couple of hours. You know what? Let's uh, let's do this. So now I should be within the uh, within the uh, open hours. Oh, this is that Valiant dealership. This is where I bought my truck. That's the truck I bought right there in front of us. So that's the uh, that's the stock version of the truck I just bought. Okay. Now one more thing I want to check out. There was the uh, information icon, which was curious. <coughs> so 
for that magnifying glass. I'm, I'm curious what that is. Let's go find out. Interesting. I'm really curious what that is. For some reason, I can't go that way. Why can't I go left? Well, maybe the world just doesn't extend that way. Oh, this is a... Uh Recruitment center, that's what it is. Yeah, it's a recruitment agency. Alright, well I think we're done for the day. Bye-bye.